What's going on, guys? It is your boy, Terabyte Reacts, back with another reaction. And today, we're going to kick things off because it has been a great day. This channel has just hit 900 subscribers. We're only 95 subscribers away from the ultimate goal that I, the big goal from day one. But I want to kick things off tonight. I'm going to do another video talking about the journey to 900 subscribers. I'll talk about it on a different video, but for now, we're just going to jump into this teaser um, that dropped for Game of Thrones, the upcoming shows on HBO, and they dropped a little bit of something, something on a trailer there. And this is the first look. Um, somebody had mentioned that this is part of the opening scene in episode one of season eight, and I'm excited to see it. So I kind of forwarded the video to the beginning of the Game of Thrones stuff because I'm not going to watch that whole entire trailer because I'm not interested in no other show on HBO right now other than Game of Thrones, okay? So let's jump into this, man. I'm excited to see it. So let's go. Let's push that play button, baby. Let's jump into it. So here's the Game of Thrones season eight first look. Boom. Let's go. Ooh, the next. Wonderful let's... is yours, your grace. Oh, what is this? All this other? That's all. That's it. Anyways, I thought we was going to see more at the end of that trailer, but I just forwarded it to the part where I saw Drogon coming out. I don't know if that's a scene from, um, it looks like it's the scene from, from season seven, from that episode, Spoils of War, um, when Daenerys came in with the, with the Dothraki coming against the Lannisters. I think that's what that's from. I'm not sure, but, um, could be new footage. I'm not sure, but anywhere down if 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 that's south you know because it look i mean it looks like the same shot it looks like the same shot and it's supposed to be snowing down there now at least so i don't think anywhere down there has that kind of greenery right now so it's crazy that's crazy but anyways let's talk about what happened in that scene let's let me go back actually let's let's go back a little bit here um, it all starts here. Ain't nobody want to watch none of Sarah Jessica Parker's ass anyways. She needs to... Oh, my. Look at these faces, man. I miss the faces, brother. I miss the faces, man. Okay, let, let's see here. See if I can pause it. Okay, so we got... God damn it. Let's break it down for a second here, man. All right, so we got Daenerys and Jorah right doesn't look like i mean i ain't see no dragons they showed the 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 um the overhead shot of winterfell but i didn't see no dragons no nothing that's obviously john right there she's smiling coming down All right <laughs> look at brienne's face I mean, Brienne looks like, I don't know what's going to happen right now. The, the thing about this scene, though, that they're showing, it's kind of obvious that Sansa, it, it kind of looks like Sansa is not happy. I don't think she's happy about this situation. John is looking like, John always has that look on his face like, man, I don't know shit. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But John always has this look on his face like, what's going on? What's going on right now? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, so um, he has that look. Not to say that he doesn't know anything. It's just how he just has that look on his face sometimes. Where it's just weird. But, man, Amelia Clark looking real good in this scene. I'm not going to lie. I love the hairstyle. Ooh, that new coat, though. I like that new coat. Um, I like this coat that she's wearing. My, it's way better than the one that she wore to when they went um over the wall there beyond the wall 
way better like i like this one i like this new design um and everything but yeah so i think that's it and you know Daenerys Chris. looks like she's giving that fake smile too all right so that scene looks like it's gonna be something we didn't see Arya at all um there's gonna be some some serious tension in Winterfell I I can feel it already I can feel it already it's gonna be some serious tension in Winterfell okay some serious serious tension and I'm I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Y'all know that we gonna be on it in April, okay? Um, new year, new things, man. It is big time. Thank you guys once again for 900 subscribers. As I said, there's more videos that I'm going to. Go. I'm sorry, you guys, for the past couple of days, I was super busy. I couldn't get the videos out. I tried. <laughs> I really did try to to do some reactions, but I couldn't. And that's why I said that I'm going to try to have a day where I just record everything and just schedule them for the week so you guys have something on the channel new to watch every day. You know, um I still have the other reaction that I other reactions that are scheduled for the end of the week like a new super reaction um the ending of the Ippo series and 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 um not not the Ippos, not the ending the just the first season the end the 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 you watch my anime videos you'll know um yeah new code gias episode and also one episode first episode of true detective and also um episode 4 of peaky blinders is supposed to drop friday saturday somewhere along the lines there um so thank you guys once again man i can't wait for the new season of game of thrones to drop i know you guys can't wait either so let me know what you think of this teaser trailer man it's uh, not really a teaser it's more of like hbo is kind of teasing their new shows and stuff like that and we just got a little bit of dialogue but it was interesting none the same if you're a true game of thrones fan and you're not one of those uptight <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, everything is all good, man. Stop fighting, guys. You know what I'm saying? Stop fighting. We all should come together as Game of Thrones fans. You know, like, I, nobody in here should be uh, all so biased against either the book readers or just the show watchers. Um, I think everybody, we're all Game of Thrones fans. And it's kind of tough sometimes, I understand, to see from another point person's point of view at this point it kind of seems like they've changed a lot of what happened in the books um kind of make it more interesting and i think they got approval from 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 george himself i would i would think so that he they got approval to make these changes so you can't hate on hbo or the writers or as you guys like to call them D D. <laughs> you know you can't hate on them you know what I'm saying? Because I'm pretty sure they got approval to do everything that they did. It's You know what I'm saying? Because he's up front and center. He's actually on the set of season eight. Like, I've seen footage of him on the set of season eight there. That's why I kept saying, like, he's still an NEP on these projects, on, on the series, on the TV series. He's still an EP, so he's present he's there i'm pretty sure he's there telling them how he plans um to end the book and this is how he would want this tv series to end i'm pretty sure that that stuff is going on so thank you guys for watching man um we need to be a community a game of thrones community uh and it's because of our love for the show why we have so many different debate debates going on you know but i don't want the book readers to hate the show watchers um and i don't want the show watchers to be hating on the book readers okay let's all come together and just understand that you know just take them for what it is man i'm planning to read the books i started off with the show and i'm gonna read the books and i'm not gonna be hating on the show because that's where i started you know what i'm saying so i'm not gonna come back and be like man the tv show is shit you know what i'm saying like i'm not gonna do that so um I, i'm cute the, the thing about it that i that I had a problem with was there, there was a lot of things that now that I'm watching the lore and the history and all of this other stuff that I'm reacting to, I'm seeing that there's a lot of stuff that they could have included that wouldn't have taken anything. You get what I'm saying? Like the, the, the whole, 
the whole thing with the triad raven him be, being the blood raven and stuff like that him just watching over and and uh with with um lord commander mormont having the, the 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 crow as a pet and talking crow for that matter um i mean talking raven i should say not a crow would have been tight that would have been nice to have on the show it wouldn't have taken that much to for them to do you know so i was a little bit pissed off that they, they, that's something they could have added just to make the 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 um the the blood raven or the three-eyed raven a little bit more important other than just making brand become the, the three-eyed raven they could have made it a little bit more interesting knowing that this guy has been i mean the dude is like so old you know what i'm saying he's been alive a hundred years and stuff like that he had a really good backstory in the books and history in the books and that was nice to learn he was he's basically a black fire and a, i mean he's a black fire targaryen stark what the <laughs> you know what i'm saying like it's just so so many facets to the three-eyed raven they could they could have weaved that in there somewhere but all in all you know tv show is still pretty good well written um but yeah um um yeah so yeah man thank you guys once again for tuning in man i'm about to go to go record because i finally have some time to record so i'm going to be recording some more lore and history so you guys can see some of that um beginning tomorrow i'm definitely going to put this out right now but i'm going to be doing some reactions for the drop tomorrow okay so thank you guys for tuning in and again as always it's your boy Terabyte Reacts. Remember to subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Okay. Um, thank you guys for watching. And again, peace.